Let's go. Immediately, <laughs> camera off. Yeah. <laughs> like, this is privacy. <laughs> Number one. Oh, by the way, have you ever seen the Gojek with the camera behind the motor motorcycle? No. Why do they so, need that for? So, uh, the camera. I, I don't know. It's it's if it's a if it's a camera, but uh, you know, like project usually they use the advertisement in the behind of the motorcycle, right? Uh huh. Ah. Uh, one time I ever see one of the project. There is a lamp in the in the advertisement. And the lamp is like usually the, uh, the like, like, like laptop camera lamp. Gitu loh. Oh. The lamp is tiny. But they're and, actually taking our photos. Yeah, I, I suspicious I suspicious that mm. they are taking our photo. It's, we, we don't have a privacy, right? Like yeah, in the middle not of the road. cool. I've never seen it though. <laughs> like like oh my god. Is this really uh, project the big company with the violation of privacy? Or probably that Gojek driver is doing some uh, vlog or something. <laughs> Personal vlog, I don't know. Yeah, maybe, but I think yeah, in Indonesia it's not like it's still like in the Japan or Korea, yeah. yeah. So like there, there are people so aware with the privacy. They need Even our consent. Good. Yes, they need our consent. Got it. Even the, but in Indonesia, the be people is wanting one is wanting to watch in TV. Like, oh, oh, mom, I'm here in the front of TV. I know, I know. <laughs> okay, let's continue with this. So, in summary, your summary is gone because Zoom cuts us. So there you go. You need to type again. Wait, let me think again. Tambate Marsha. Summarize. Marsha is tired from the gymnastic class. And uh, my eyes are tired from the heat. If you look no. at my yeah, look it's at very my, hot. I know. Look at my eyes. It's extremely small. I literally turned on the air conditioner. Ugh, my <laughs> aircon doesn't work. So there you go. Like <gasps> really, this day the 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 heat is very very extremely really heat. So oh my god, even my skin get into the red one. <laughs> so uh, hot. Upper cheek look. Uh, red. Your, oh, your this cheek filter. looks red. <laughs> this filter. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> you use filter? Yeah. Uh, oh my. What, what, what's called like? This is the apa ya? The touch up, touch up my appearance. Oh, so like, uh, oh wait, 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 I want to try. <laughs> like, like, like. Mm. Oh, and 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 oh, just yeah, yeah, long yeah, yeah. light, so mm -hmm. it's getting. <laughs> right there. <laughs> got it. Got it. Got it. Uh, like, like, right, right. <laughs> gone then. But really, like, like in the Sunday, so hot until my skin so. Oh yeah, Sunday was hot. Even the evening was thirty-two degrees. I don't care the the weather vacation said that I I care about the feels, the real feels, like so hot, even 30, 32 but I know. Uh, Wait, I don't know. I know what's wrong. One benefit of effective time management is reducing frustration. So, in summary, there is a beneficial thing by yes, by doing nice. effective time management, but it's not clear. Oh, uh, well, I kind of confused. Like, can I say, in summary, there is a beneficial thing by doing effective time management. It is reducing frustration. It's the same as the thesis statement then. You summarize timing. Yeah, that's that's why I 
I cannot write. If you, uh, this is the deal. Try to find synonyms for some words. For example, yes. oh, yeah. for example, you want to use reducing frustration. What is the synonym of reducing? Uh, decrease. Decreasing, got it. Lessening, there you go. Frustration. Lower. Stress. Lowering stress, there you go. You get your other ideas for that. So you can use oh. those words instead of reducing. How okay. about okay. effective time management? What other words can you use for that? Quick. Mm -hmm. Or benefit. Benefit is easy. What's another word for benefit? Um, benefit. It's benefit. Uh, advantage. 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 There. Advantage. Advantage. Oh, yeah. advantage. Mm. Go on. Make up your sentence using those words. Uh, It's different though, the heat here and the heat in say the Gulf countries like Saudi Arabia or Hawaii. Yeah. Like they are desert country. Desert. The hot is so different with us. Desert, desert. It can be 50 degrees there, but it won't be as hot as it is here. It's the humidity that that makes it hot. Summer is an advantage of when I talk to yeah, my Marcia, teacher, teacher, you can also my change. sister. Pardon? Your sister? When I say to my sister, I said, oh, this is not like a common heat. The heat is like one to, they uh, come to our skin, like, oh, let me in, let me in, let me in, like that. <laughs> <laughs> Marcia, you can, also, you can also change the position. So to summarize, a good time management is a, an advantage of, uh, no, to summarize, decreasing frustration is another Increase. advantage. Decreasing frustration. Mm -hmm. Fr frustration. I. Typo, typo, typo. Oh, oh, yeah. Frustration. Frustration, yeah. Mm. Decreasing frustration uh, is an advantage of a good time management. You can do it like that. So is really completely different from the thesis statement. <laughs> retype, retype. I don't think oh, that. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> we'll summarize. Decreasing frustration Oops. is an advantage of a good time management. Increasing or decreasing? Decreasing. Your sentence is decreasing. Frustration is one of the advantages of. Remember, when you use one of, the next part should be in plural. It's okay, bud. I can move it. sum up there is a value by doing effective schedule management uh, this is uh, redundant bar you are using there and then it is is okay to sum up oh yeah okay check this one out your sentence can be like this to sum up the value of doing effective schedule management is decreasing depression uh, please okay. retype Summarize, decreasing frustration is one of the advantages of a good time. Yeah, Ovlo Marsha, it's another typo. Oh, Maanga, man. To summarize, decreasing 
Expiration. Pay attention to your spelling. Okay. Also punctuation. Um. Wait, before you enter, yeah. Ah. <laughs> I was about to say, before you enter, please check. Now it's my negamatan. Okay, wait, 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 wait. Open Google Doc. If both of you, please open Google Doc and type in Google Doc. Okay. It's so difficult to edit here. Okay. You don't get the chance to oh. edit. By, by, by the way, I don't understand with the like what what the mean of coherent or inherent. Coherent or inherent? Coherent is um, it makes sense. The whole thing. It's like when you make a necklace between one beat mm -hmm. to another, it makes a pattern that's coherent. Okay. okay. Marcia Akbar, have you opened a Google Doc for a form file? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I make one and then share to you. Mm. Each of you can make one and then share the link in the group. <laughs> I haven't got the have I? Oh, you have. I turned off my sound so I didn't really okay. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. It's okay. I change the time management to schedule management. Sure, sure, no problem. We'll see if it's coherent or not. Mm. Marcia, your Google Doc link. By the way, do you know why Miss Amel is absent? Why? Why? why, why. None of you know why. No. Okay, no problem then. I'm looking, I'm looking for the reason. What's going on? Marcia, your Google Doc link in the group. You are muted, by the way. I cannot hear anything that you say, Marsha. Hello? Marsha. Yeah, oh, Marsha. <laughs> so I could talk it alone. <laughs> I don't understand what you say because you are muted. So I was like, what is Marsha talking about? Wait, the WhatsApp web is kind of long. It takes a long time. I know. 
YouTube is having a trouble again this morning, I think. I had problem opening videos. To sum up, the value of constructive schedule, why constructive bar? Constructive and constructive and effective are different in meaning. Oh, but in the Google dictionary, it's the synonym. Synonym, I know, but sometimes synonym okay. in different parts. So when you talk about effective, it means that it doesn't take much time, but it has maximum result. When you talk mm. about constructive, it's about making oh, yeah, something yeah, yeah. better. That's why you also need to be wise in choosing oh, your wait, synonym. Wait, wait. I think I like like um what you know Indonesia ever changed the effective with the Sangkil or Mangkus I think with what pardon match Sangkil and Mangkus effective and efficient. Oh, it's replaced with Sangkil and Mangkus. I don't even the know that. My yes. Indonesian, what, so my Indonesian teacher I forgot my sentence. Has told Access me. denied, Marsha. Huh? Oh, Access really? denied. You didn't open your Google Doc for public. Wait, wait, wait. wait can I ask mm -hmm. something? I forgot my sentence. I forgot my sentence. It's okay. We will do it later when you have your Google Doc link. So first, please open your Google Doc link. But you already have your sum up. The value of effective schedule management is decre decreasing depression. Now, do you want your final words to be a call for action or a thought provoking question? Make your final words first and then fill the in between be... after that. Call for action. I want to be the thought provoking question. <laughs> what do you have? We'll... Okay, now Marcia's paragraph is open. Okay. So Marcia, your Completely. sentence is to summarize. To summarize. One of the advantages of good time management is decreasing the de depression. That was your sentence. Decreasing what? Decreasing depression. No. Decreasing frustration. Yeah. Frustration. Yeah. I'm looking for the example. You can open your own student book, you know, yeah. you have the link to your yes. student book. Now, Marcia, what's the final word for you? A thought provoking question or a call for action? Call for action. Call for action, then make it. Later on, we will just have to. Miss, I'm sorry, what? What did you just say? Thought provoking, uh, sorry, call for action, you said? Yeah. Yeah, then make it. Oh, okay. Type your thought provoking question. Hmm? Call for action, call for action. Oh yeah, sorry, call for action, so sorry. Okay. The middle part of concluding paragraph is about summary of the essay, right? So it should be easy when you already make the concluding sentence and the final words. 
they start to 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 mm. when you said call for action it should be more than just can can is a suggestion you should you should you must you have to there mm. but you said a thought provoking question i i don't think i think Come on, something simple. You have to manage your time better from now on. There you go. Now, make a summary of the paragraphs. So we have two paragraphs in between. Oh, sorry, three paragraphs. Make three sentences at least for the summary one two three open your own ebook marsha <laughs> you are But that's not a question by having an ability to make effective time management. No, I do to call it call for action, call for action. Oh, you, you change it to call for action. But then again, if you make a call for action, like I said to Marcia, you need to use imperative words. Either you start with the, the action, for example, have an ability to or start managing your time or um, be effective with your time management or something. So it should be an order, a call for action. If you make a sentence like this, this is not a call for action. You know how you can make your sentence into call for action, but by deleting words. Wow. There, that's a call for action. Make effective time management and you will have a better life. You are telling people to make effective time management. That's a call for action. But when you say, uh, have the ability to make blah, 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 people will say, oh, yeah, yeah. But not, oh, yeah. Okay, there oh. you go. Imperative. It needs to be really telling people what to do. Okay, now please make three sentences in between as a summary of the essay. I will have to end the Zoom session at nine. If you haven't finished with the summary, your deadline is until 12 midnight. So you may do it yourself, but please just finish your 
paragraph, okay? It's not that difficult to make the summary. Oh, yeah. There you go. Google advise you to choose uh, to delete and make effective time management. And you will have a better life. Marcia is still reading the essay. <laughs> So what's going on, Mr. Mr. Lutis Ria? Mr. Pardon? What's going on with Mr. Amel? Mr. What? This is Miss Amel. <laughs> oh my god. What's going uh, on with Miss Amel? That if she doesn't she tell you why she is uh, absent for this week, you need to tell you need to ask her yourself then. I cannot share the okay. news with you. Okay, no. Maybe next week. Guess, guess if you want to. Oh, if Mary. Yeah. Oh, oh great. Last Sunday. Oh, great. <laughs> so this is. Hmm? Oh, who is who's October Mr. Alfian. October 24. You don't know Mr. Alfian? You don't remember? I'm sorry, the short one? Oh, where? Mm -mm. Woo! Seriously? Seriously, I'm not joking. This is okay. my concluding paragraph in the summarize one of the advantages is uh, Marcia, you miss your periods. It's decreasing frustration, period. Another benefit of time oh, yeah. is feeling less overwhelmed. Mm. Wait, less overwhelm is a part of decreasing frustration, Marcia. It's not another benefit. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It's true. Right, right. Oh, okay. my Zoom is taking so long. I'm breaking up here. Um. So, okay, I'm going to let you finish it on your own. Do you have any questions yeah. before I end the Zoom? Uh, I think it's clear. So we have to make uh, three sentences, right? A summary. To, to fill in the remember do not copy paste what's in the essay <laughs> do not copy paste but restate yeah. 
the the okay. Song. okay. Yeah. Okay, I will. <laughs> I will change the words. Mm. There you go. You already know the trick. Don't do the mistake, <laughs> but do the trick. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I'll be waiting for your concluding paragraph to finish. I'll monitor it through Google Docs. Okay. Thank you for joining today's lesson, everyone. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Assalamualaikum. Yeah.